was chaotic. I'm sorry for dragging you into all this. It was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. Hmm. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Hmm. Not good at all. I don't know what it is. So, you make nice with everyone? Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. So, it wasn't that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2000 remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. And you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. Guess it's time for introductions. Okay in there? Oh. Coming in.
But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. So they blew up a reactor so they could save the planet? More like they want us to give up our way of life. There will be no way of life for anyone. This disaster's cost a lot of folks their livelihoods. Shinra needs to do something to show the people they're on their side. At the end of the day, it's just a company. They're not on anyone's side but their own. The Watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. How? Ain't they short-handed? Absolutely. But, with the bombing and all, they're trying extra hard to recruit more people. Until they get Reactor 1 back up and running, the factory is station. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it! I've developed a new materia! Your battle intel submissions. The 
Marines don't start moving again, we're not gonna have enough food and other goods to go around. Could get ugly. The Watch is here to keep the peace. If anything happens, we'll step in immediately. Been some talk about a girl who went to Wall Market and never came home. We're doing our best to keep a lid on things, increasing patrols and recruiting more. Might be a good idea to stock up on food before it's all gone. <sighs> Nothing more. One of the Antwall girls who got. Hey. I've chatted with that Barrett guy a few times. Looks like a real hard ass, but he's actually pretty chill. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <sighs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jessie put her mind to it. <sighs> Most every home in the area has one. Folks <sighs> love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. <sighs> we bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh. Please? <sighs> Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. 